Hey guys, Beast from Beast Toys here coming at you. Going to do an opening of some vintage collection figures. Got some uh, Star Wars line coming at you. Couple there. Got a couple more over here. Clone Wars. Do Commander Wolf. Return of the Jedi. Gamorrean Guard repack. And last but not least, Mando Buildup Walmart exclusive. Um, comes with the child. Looking at this, uh, got mm, most of those. I never did get a Han though. Have to go back and get one of those. Anyway, set some of these aside. We'll get started. Um, get started on these. Whoa! There they all go. Down to the floor. We'll start with Han. So yeah, I've got, uh, here's your Han. I think he was a Target exclusive. I got him. He's in a wave a while back. Comes with the regular uh, Rogue One Stormtrooper, Praetorian Guard. I think that's what that is, Imperial Stormtrooper. I'm pretty sure Phasma, Chewbacca, yeah, Lando. Anyway, I know I ordered two of these, so. Oh, there it is. There he is, artwork, good artwork. Show you the back there from the wave he came from. Like I said, there's some guys on there. I'll check those out real quick. So let's go ahead and crack him open. Bought two of these when he came out. Some tar Target. Actually, I hate Target. I'm not going to plug Target as little as possible. So I went down there the other day to get... Uh, The Keldor and oh, Kronos pack from Mattel, the He-Man pack. There we go. There's Han. I'm going to put his helmet on, make him look like a stormtrooper now. You can't really tell. Comes with, oh, oh yeah, it comes with the holster even better. I'm going to put his gun in the holster. If I can fit it, that's kind of like smashed down, it looks like. I don't even know if he can. I'm not so sure. That's not more for... More for show? I don't even know if you can fit that in there. I'll leave the Hasbro to do some quirky stuff sometimes. Yeah, I don't even know if that'll fit. I'm gonna have to put it in his hand. I'm just gonna put it down in there. I like putting her putting her in their guns and their holsters, but nothing doing here. Alright, well knock on Hasbro sometimes. They're not always the best on what they do. Anyway, helmet on. Put his blaster in his hand, and we'll move on to the next one. Um, so yeah, so anyway, I go down to Target, let's finish that story real quick. Um, says they have them in stock. I happened to see an article uh, or someone post in a group on Twitter. Of course, people are getting them, buying them, yeah, 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 okay. My Target says in stock, I'm like, oh. Say, uh, say Pop Finder and Brick Seeker, correct? So I follow the link, and sure enough, it says mine are in stock. Not limited, there's two below them that are 50 minutes to an hour away. There he is in his, all his glory. Good looking figure though, say that. Anyway, um, so we make a trip down on my lunch hour. Nonetheless, I got about an hour on Friday. I'm like, all right, I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna hustle and go down to this place and try to get it. Okay, so uh, go, get down there kind of in a hurry because I'm only limited on time. Here's my Shadow Trooper coming up. Show you the back. His wave in the back. My Sith Trooper opening my last videos in his wave. Sith Jet Trooper is. So there's some of the guys in his wave. Anyway, long short. Go look. Nothing on the shelves. Go ask an associate. Says, oh, those. This is on the 23rd. Today's 24th. Tomorrow's 25th. Says, oh, they're, they're due out on the 25th. We're doing a reset. Baloney. I've heard that line before. That's such garbage we're doing a reset and they'll be out then yeah okay somebody probably wants them he's like well i've had someone ask already today but i know i know we got three of them and i want to be like all right dude well you know the problem is i can't pre you know you people are pricks you're not going to do whatever but um other stores are selling them already or their employees are buying them so i don't know i'm probably not going to get up and go I'd like to get up and go in the morning, but you know what? I hate to lose sleep. I'm, I'm about done losing sleep over trying to grab stuff. It's just not, it's just irks me. It's not worth it. 
Now this is a cool figure. Uh, no holster for either, well not either, you're gonna have one for the rifle, blaster rifle of course, but not for his E11. No holster. Checking mount, bins. Man, I, this would be the one I don't wanna break if I break one, I don't wanna accidentally break one and then, ooh. Yeah, I'm not gonna be, not gonna get too forceful. This one's really cool. I love Shadow Troopers too, they're really neat. So, I got an old school black, came from Hong Kong or China or one of those places, Japan. Um, what was that, about three or four years ago, bought a, I was trying to buy this big vintage lot. I was on vacation camping. We happened to be up in a place where I had a signal and uh, it went, I, Surprisingly, didn't buy it. I've spent way more now on other smaller uh, amounts, I guess would be the way to say, of stuff. But uh, anyway, long short, I didn't get it, so I bought a, found that black. Looks just like the original um, black Shadow Trooper. Uh, I don't remember, it may be out my display case with my, uh, all my other, oh, all my other ones, all my other original Kenners. Anyway, back to this. So, uh, yeah, anyway, I got screwed at Target, too, to finish that store, so I don't know if I'll go get one or not. Oh, I'd like to get that pack. I'd like to get two, as I always do, one to open, one to keep, but right now on the He-Man line, I haven't, I haven't got everything. I've got Wave 1 and 2, and partial of way, all but one, I think it might, didn't get a Triclops, but I don't know, I think that's Wave 4 or 5 already. Uh, they had Wave 3 when I went in there a while back, and I didn't buy them. Oh, I held off for some reason and wished I wouldn't have because I went back and they were all gone. Oh, I know why, because the shearer was all banged up and I was like, well, I'd really like to get them all in good shape, so I'll wait, maybe come back and see if they get another one or something, but oh well. All right, so got Commander Wolf here. Love me some clones, love me some clones. His holsters look like they are gonna hold these, unlike my stormtroopers over there. Um, there he is, we'll take a quick shot of him pre helmet and we'll put his helmet on put his guns in his holsters like I said I like holstering gun I like to keep my guns holstered if I ever want to display them or do something like that or even maybe mess with them play with them whatever I don't know I haven't really played with toys in years even though I've got back into them the last two or three years I don't I just open them but I don't really play with them um, I don't know I think people do still beats me anyway there he is. I don't like the little thing on his arm that sticks out, though. That's kind of annoying, but whatever. Here's what it is. I can pull his arms out a little bit. Give him the draw look. Like, I'm going to draw my arc pistols out. Oh, no. Speaking of drawing one out, there goes one. Fell out. thought that thing was in there good, too. Weird. All right, well, I'm gonna fix it and put it back and move along. But, uh... He seems to bend pretty good. Check his legs. Yeah, he bends real good. That's just weird. Some of these, they bend good. Knees and feet, everything bends really good. There you go. There's your good shot of him. Once again, our up close picture. All right, got one of these open. Um, bought bought a lot of three seven five figures off of some guy and uh he said he'd throw in two vintage collection figures he had in the picture or the picture that, that was with some of them and of course i took the, the gam guard and uh oh i can't think of his name one of the trade federation dudes he's not 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 viceroy but i forget what his name is anyway i think he was a vintage collection debut figure so to speak uh, when he came out he's been out for a little while but anyway in the grand scheme of all of this at least this guy's oh this guy's helmet comes off well that's different that's the first time i've ever i didn't notice that on the other one i guess it's probably not as this one seems loose anyway i'm trying to get this staff out of there a little tape around it. There we go. 
yell that out. Get my Mando build up pack out here in just a second. So there he is. He's a little stiff. Of course, he's bigger. But I gotta say, this was one of my favorite characters growing up as a kid. Um, I have two or three of these, actually. I think I have three. The original Kinder versions, of course. Um, but of course, these are neater, more realistic look. Uh, that whole, whole bit. Give him an axe. There you go. Looks looks like a Gamorrean guard to me. Legs bend. They bend, yeah, his arms. This guy, why is it, like, the stinking K2SO's thinner and this guy bends a heck of a lot better. I don't know. Weird. I don't know. Hasbro's weird with their figures. That's all I can say. But they're cool, and I still buy them, so... All right, last but certainly not least, da -da 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 -da, Mando and Child Build-Up Pack. Walmart exclusive. I know lots of people. Oh, this one. Oh, this one's already loose on the thing. Lots of people do not like Walmart exclusives either. I just complain about Target. I think Target's worse. Walmart isn't terribly far off the beaten path, but at least with Walmart, I can go in and find them. Uh-huh. Uh, Target, not so much. Don't like to wait in line. Oh, cool. Well, canister opens. That's neat. Not sure what I can put in there. So, Mando, this Mando here comes with lots of goodies. Jetpack. Of course, I don't like the plastic, or the plastic cape. I wish I could give him. Oh, see, so I guess you pop his helmet off. You can switch his, put his head put his regular head in. I'm not going to. Blaster pistol already in holster. That's nice. Comes with the well, let's see, credit or best car credit and then I don't know what's the little box? I guess it's a stack of best car. Um, Mando head. Yeah, you get a man the extra extra Mando head. Supposed to get his rifle, but again, kind of one of those rifles and that you get that uh, you actually. There's the the child, tiny, super tiny in the vintage, very small scale. Um, his arms and head move though. That's kind of cool. Of course, jetpack is. Yeah, that's one of those deals. If you want the jetpack, you gotta take the stinking row or take the cape off. I don't know. I'm a big cape guy. I like capes. I don't know why. I just I like the idea of capes. Caped figures are cooler. All right, so I'm gonna use this canister to hold my stacks of Beskar. I can get it back open again. Opened really. Oh, there we go. Looks like it opened easy a second ago. There we go. Little canister. It's kind of a neat pack, though. Got lots of neat stuff. So let's check him out real quick. Probably be the one I break. No, don't say that. Mando. Still trying to get Mando in his best car armor. There's the head pop, so I can switch the heads and take the cape off, but I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the cape on. Put the head back on. Alright, very cool. Last last one of the of the group. Mando build up, so alright, so there we go. Call it the danger in. Dinger in pack. So, all right, cool deal. Um, I don't have any more to open. I got a little room in that box for some more. So, I guess I'll find something else to open later. Anyway, all right, guys. Well, there you have it. Five more Vintage Collection figures open. So, 
As always, hit that like and subscribe button. And thanks for watching my videos. And uh, I'm Beast from Beast Toys. We'll see you.